Hey guys, this is TJ with View Rail, and today I'm here to help you get some exact measurements for your glass railing. You received a glass railing measuring kit and a post layout drawing. What you'll want to do is grab that drawing, identify run one, and once you've identified run one, go to that area on your deck and uh, we'll proceed to the next step. So you've received your kit. Um, this one, we've got uh, base rail templates here. Um, we've got two of them inside of the kit. One's representing a, a straight termination. The other one is going to be representing a corner termination. So uh, to set this template in place um, in a corner, what we're going to do is uh, on an outside corner here, we want to take into effect the uh, outside bull nose or overhang of your deck. So on this deck here, um, we're going to measure that bull nose. Got a one inch bull nose on one side of the, of the corner here. And on the opposite side, we also have a one inch bull nose. So in setting this template in place, we want to position it so that this mounting screw uh, is going directly into the backing that's underneath this finished material here. And that it's offset that one inch from the bull nose. So measuring that out. Ensuring that we're one inch from that, we can go ahead and take the provided screws and mount this template in place. All right, now that we've got our corner set with our, with our base rail template on the opposite end, I've come to this end. Uh, I've got a staircase that's gonna be descending behind me here, so I'm gonna take my straight uh, um, template here and place it on the, on the perimeter of the deck here, ensuring again, guys, that we, are, that we are taking into account the overhang and that when we're mounting this template, we're mounting it in the exact location that the base rail is going to be in. So measure our overhang and we've got exactly a one inch overhang on this side too. So I'm going to be pulling this template back placing it exactly one inch from the edge. So I have that set, ensuring that I'm in line with, with the template on the opposite end there. I can go ahead and mount this template in place. All right, now that we've got both of these templates set, we can go ahead and pull the measurement of run one here. Um, so when doing this, you wanna hook the tape measure to the outside leading edge of the, uh, of the base rail template here. Snag the tape measure there, go to the opposite end, and measure again to the opposite end of this run. And on this measurement, I've got 143 and a quarter. Now that we've got that measurement of 143 and a quarter, we're gonna record it on the backside of this template guide. So on the backside here, we've got a run type. Uh, we went from an outside corner to a straight. So we'll record that um, in the length of 143 and a quarter. Uh, really, all you have to do is repeat that same process throughout the, um, the rest of your runs on your project, your level runs. And once completed, submit to us and we'll get started on your glass engineered drawings and providing you your railing.